No way. Welcome to Plain It For Me. I'm your host slash new BFF, Louis Barragona. I've been scrolling through my phone reading your DMs and I just got a great one from someone dealing with major bridesmaid drama. Yikes, big yikes. Before we get into all that though, I'm gonna need a cocktail. I think I'm gonna have one of my favorites, the Girl Code Gimlet Chef's Kiss. It works every time. <laughs> so I feel like the best way to like enter a dramatic situation is usually with a drink. In case you haven't seen an episode of Real Housewives, <laughs> they always have their drink ready for throwing, but no one is gonna be throwing anything today. That's just not happening here. I'm very experienced with a shaker, just kidding. I usually just pour things in and hope for the best. Ooh. This thing is not like effective. Okay. We need some, mm, mm. gotta have the gin on deck. We're gonna throw it in here with some ice. Um, okay, next we need some simple syrup. Not so simple problems, simple syrup. Mm. Okay, like an ounce. Ooh. Clearly you guys, I am a pro. I have never been such a pro in my life. I just, and then we need some lime. Ooh. I'm a man of strength. Ooh. And then, shake it up. Ah! <laughs> Pour it up, pour it up. It's good. Oh my God, it's so good. Hello. It's really good, I swear. Okay, I got this DM from I Love Drama 7-Eleven and I think they need help. They wrote, my bridesmaids are uber opinionated. They hate any and all dress suggestions and they don't wanna go anywhere I like for the bachelorette party. But they also don't really help with planning despite all their opinions. What do I do when my bridesmaids barely feel like my best friends? Wowza. <laughs> For now, let's hold off on the dresses. I think I've got someone who can help us. Let's tackle the bachelorette, which means it's a perfect time for a little cocktail. Drink up. So here's the thing. How about you try creating some sort of pull on a site like Doodle? No, this isn't sponsored. Pay me, you know my Venmo. Or do something on your Instagram close friends. That way they'll still be able to express one of their 1000 opinions, but at least there's a little bit of a cap on the options. Also, it goes without saying that it might be time for a tough convo. Maybe your bridesmaids aren't on board for financial reasons, so you might need to pose options that range in terms of cost. For an opinionated perfectionist bunch, it sounds like they could be of service when it comes to those small tasks you don't want to necessarily take on or remember. Delegate duties and have them run point on things like the shower, which I doubt you're even wanting to think about right now, or the accommodations the night before the big day. Stuffing the welcome bags, getting together any favors, all that good stuff. They can do it, I promise. Um, who's interrupting cocktail time? Oh God. So like, are you into this? No, absolutely not. Never, absolutely not. <laughs> but I do need your help. Shelly Brown, senior fashion and beauty editor, the expert, I just got a DM. Oh, a guy from Tinder? No, Shelly, not him again. I'm sorry, I just it's, wasn't sure. It's okay. It's from I Love Drama 7-Eleven. Oh. She's got some issues with picky bridesmaids who hate her dress picks. What can a bride do if their bridesmaids can't agree on a dress? So this is a super common problem, and we hate it when this happens. I do think the best thing a bride can do is to allow their bridesmaids room to honor their own individual tastes. So give them a color swatch or a Pantone chip and a few helpful suggestions, like the length, the fabric, the style that you're going for, and then let them bring their faves to you, of course, subject to your veto. Of course, veto always. It is a democracy, not a dictatorship. I love that. You still maintain the power, but they've got the element of choice. Absolutely, and we're seeing so many weddings that use mix and match bridal parties, so it's the perfect time to let everyone choose their own adventure or retire. Love it, choose your own adventure. That's how we operate here in <laughs> weddings these days. You do you, it's amazing. That's super helpful. Now that you've helped me out, I have a question for you. Yeah? Do you want a cocktail? Uh, I wish, but I have to figure out how to get rid of this dress ASAP. Yeah, it's true, you do. Yeah. Bye Shelly, have Bye, fun. Lewis. Get rid of it, get it out. Bye everyone, see you next time on Planet For Me where you slide in my DMs and I plan it for you, you lucky, lucky people. Bye. <laughs>